Infratex Sophia uses different sample cells depending on the size of the particular grain being analysed. The sample cells can be changed while the instrument is powered on or powered off. However, the sample handling wheel must not be moved under any circumstances while the power supply is connected to the instrument or the motor will be damaged. To change the sample cell while the instrument is powered on, pull out the sample drawer and lift the instrument hood exposing the sample handling wheel. Place one hand on the drum of the sample handling wheel to keep it from moving. While holding the sample handling wheel in position, remove the front cover. The cover is attached to the nut, so it is removed when the nut is loosened from the cover to be lifted away. Then lower the hood of the instrument back to position, without replacing the drawer. From the main menu of Infratech Sophia, press the soft key tools. Press the down arrow soft key to go down to rotate SHW180 then press the soft key OK. Press the soft key 180 to rotate the sample handling wheel 180 degrees around, bringing the cells to the top. You will hear the wheel rotating. Lift the hood of the instrument again. Now the sample cell is easily accessible and can be changed. Lift out the sample cell from its position in the sample handling wheel. Take the new sample cell, in this example the sample cell for analysing canola, and insert it into the same position as the previous sample cell. All sample cells have the same notch in the rim of the cylinder, which guides correct positioning of the cell in the sample handling wheel. Make sure the cell clicks into place with the matching pin. Place the sample cell you have removed into the accessory kit for safekeeping. There are two square holes cut into the foam padding for the storage of additional sample cells. Now close the hood. Press the soft key home to rotate the sample handling wheel 180 degrees. You will hear the wheel rotating. Once it has stopped rotating, open the hood. Refit the faceplate. Check the notches line up as you refit it. It should click into place. Then hand tighten the nut until it is finger tight. Close the drawer. Remember before using the Sophia unit to test canola sample, the software will need to be set up using the following steps. On the screen you will have the Rotate Sample Handling Wheel menu. Press the back soft key to go to the Tools menu. At the Tools menu, press the Menu soft key to go back to the Sophia Main menu. You are now back at the Infratech Sophia Main menu. Press the soft key Analyze to go to the Analyze view. Now press the soft key Grain, shown here. Use the up-down arrow keys to scroll down to the new commodity type, in this case Canola. Once the Canola commodity is highlighted, Press the soft key Select to pick this commodity. Now the Infratech Sophia is ready to analyse canola samples.